Hello, Sagittarius, and welcome back to my channel. T to the Y to the N to the A R A. All right, today we want to see what's going on in your energy. So, Spirit, please give me a message for the Sagittarius Collective. Remember, this is a general reading. If you want a personal, please check out bantamara.com for oracle decks, for protection oils, and all that other goodies. We do have um, done for you ebooks. If you have your own business and you want to create ebooks and sell ebooks to make some online money, you can buy the books yourself for a low price and you can put your own title and logo on it and sell it yourself. So, there's all types of goodies on the, web the website. Please check it out. All right, we're going to see what energy is coming towards you. So, Spirit, please give me a message for the Sagittarius Collective. What would you like them to know today? Okay, there seems to be this energy here where somebody is holding on. Someone is holding on to your energy, kind of expecting you to apologize for something. There's this energy where somebody wants your forgiveness. They expect the apology in reference to either them feeling like you are the reason why something got stopped or why they lost some money or why something isn't flowing the way that it needs to flow. Somebody feel like you stifled their opportunity with something or the fact that there seems to be something centered around somebody not feeling and really appreciated and they're expecting you to apologize about something. Let's see what else is going on. What is it that they're holding on to? They're holding on. Somebody seems to be holding on to some resentment or old problem or something that happened. It seemed like this happened a long time ago, but somebody would not let something go unless you apologize. I feel like this individual sends you mixed signals because one minute it seemed like things are fine. And then the next minute there is this energy where they're pulling apart from you. I almost get this feeling that somebody don't know what they want to do. <laughs> You're confusing me. What is it that you want? The great pretenders acts uninterested but stalks you. And reflection. Okay. Why is this person wanting Sagittarius to apologize? Let's see what else we have. It could be this energy where somebody is coming back in your energy. Maybe y'all have not spoken in a while and now they're coming back up. And so... This could be, be a past friend or a person you used to date. Maybe this person. I almost feel like this person is coming around in a sense of saying like, okay, I would be friends with Sagittarius. I would talk to Sagittarius or we could mend our fences or I would be fine with talking to them again once they apologize for the way they hurt me or the fact that they stopped this opportunity. Maybe somebody feel like you got in the way of them getting a job or you got in the way of them getting some money from somebody. I don't know. Something could be related to somebody's birthday I just heard. There's also this energy of somebody feeling like you either could have said something hurtful you could have been too blunt you could have did something that affected them in some type of way and so it feel, almost feels like this person says it's all right i'm over it i'm over it that's not a small thing to a giant but really here they go telling somebody else that once a sagittarius apologized then we can talk once they say whatever but to you it seems like they're ignoring you or they just don't care but you know they really feel some type of way
I feel like you can see this person's true colors or it's coming out. I feel like, especially with this divine feminine energy coming out here, the divine feminine is the energy. It's just energy. It's the energy of attracting. Feminine energy is to attract something to you, to draw something in, to be creative, all that type of energy. So I feel like this person, you can, you're can, you either sensing it or you can feel it or it's coming to you. Do the grapevine. It's coming through somebody that you are hearing about this. You feel like you're not looking for it. You don't even care to ask about it. But as you see, it's resurfacing. Something's coming back up. You're finding out about it. Let's see how this is coming out. Reappearing at the period of time. The great pretender is out here. Somebody acts like they let them to go when really they don't because you heard it through somebody else that they still want you to apologize. What is it that this person, who wants Sagittarius to apologize? Somebody feels like we have the moon coming out in reverse. So... This could be a Pisces. This person even felt like you even spoke on something that was a secret of theirs. Or with the magician coming out, you interfered in their life. Maybe you did something. Let's see what else. Yeah, this is a this is a water sign. This could be a Pisces or a Cancer that's coming out. What's come it looks like this person is upset that either they feel like you didn't take action to come towards them to support them or help them during some type of time. This could have been the birth of a baby or I feel like this is either somebody's mother or this could be the birth of a baby or something. You was not there. Or you didn't really take the right type of action towards them or that maybe a secret was revealed. I almost feel like somebody's gaslighting something. Maybe this person could have told your secret. You stopped talking to them. And next thing you know, this person is saying that they want you to apologize because the way you reacted towards them like you did something maybe you would especially with the magician coming out here this is somebody controlling controlling their mind their heart their body this is a person that's making some taking some action and especially with it coming on upright i feel like you could have reacted some type of way and this is why the person wants you to apologize i feel like this person told your secret you reacted in a certain type of way they didn't they didn't expect and they thought you was going to come off as being nice and loving and this is what i'm seeing i see it all day long somebody didn't think your reaction would be the type of way that you will either speak to them a certain type of way you would act a certain type of way or like i feel like <laughs> You don't know how a person is going to respond when somebody reacts. This person did not. Ex this person did not have this. Re this <laughs> Lord, I'm getting tongue tied trying to get this out, and I feel like this is what you're going through. This is not me. I feel like this is what you're going through. Somebody told your secret. This is what I'm saying. Somebody told your secret, and you reacted in a certain type of way that they did not expect. Did not expect. They thought you was gonna come off as nurturing and loving and caring. This could be your mother, or or this Pisces or Cancer. They thought it was gonna be you was just gonna be fine with it, and you wasn't. What else is going on? So this is why, okay, this is why I see that this person acts like, they act like they don't care, but behind your back, they telling everybody else, Sagittarius need to come apologize to me because they shouldn't have reacted in that type of way. I'm their mother. They should not talk to me that way. And you're like, no, you cross boundaries or you cross boundaries. I don't take back anything that I said. I said what I said the way that I said it because you told my business or you vented about something with this moon card. This is the moon is the moon in the upright is a secret, but in the reverse, this is bringing light to some type of secret. So I feel like this person told your business. And they ran around telling different people or talking about you and said something that nobody had no business saying. And you being a magician, you reacted. You did something. I 
I feel like this person has caused some type of problem because they either, you could have vented to this person. You could have told them how you felt. You could have told some told them uh, something that was, you could have told them a secret. And you felt like they was unconcerned about your feelings by going to go spread this. This wasn't for everybody else. You just gave this information to them. You feel like this person took something and ran with it with the Page of Swords. Page of Swords is giving me the, um, the energy of an immature person. This is a messenger. So I feel like this person went and gossiped. Now, this could be an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra as well but this person went took that information spread it around you see these clouds being spread around and now somebody's wanting you to apologize for the way you reacted to them doing this to you i feel like okay what I feel like this person could have said, they even talked about your financial situation or what you're doing, which, yeah, how you spend your money. Either you have student loans, you have bills, or you just switched your job, or you're moving out of a house, or how you're trying to juggle life. This is kind of what they told. And then you feel like it's nobody else's business, like how you spend your money or what's going on with your finances or the financial decisions you're making or maybe that you're stressed out with your finances and you're trying to juggle. You're trying to juggle between work or you lost a babysitter or something like that or how you had to switch between homes. I feel like there, there's two of pentacles is you juggling between something. I feel like this is what this is. This is what this person told. They could have told this Capricorn or this Earth sign. You feel like this person kind of stabbed you in the back with telling your business about your hardship. And now this is kind of fair that you had is that you don't like people knowing. Maybe you're kind of secretive or quiet or if you don't like people knowing anything about you, that's not your business. That's not their business. Here we go. This Gemini energy coming out again. So you feel like you were stabbed in the back. And so now. Here you go, Knight of Swords. This is going and rushing back, like telling this person, why did you do this or tell that? Or why would you tell somebody about what I'm going through? So you was really, this is somebody being impulsive. This is somebody being reactive. This is somebody speaking their honest truth and being direct about it. This is somebody really being direct. This is you being assertive. Here we go. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. Even this person could have also said how maybe you had to borrow some money from them to like buy something or do something, but they went and told somebody. And I feel like this is this is a parent that told almost giving me like this parent is gossiping to the aunties or the uncles or the siblings. They're gossiping to somebody telling your business. About what you had, yeah, as you see, unpaid bills, money problems, bad debts, or something. So now you're just in this energy of, you're in this energy of like being defensive now or like now I got to wash my back with everyone with the nine of wands coming out. Now you're like, I got to wash my back with everyone. I don't trust anyone now. I've been into this person, but now I don't know if I should even be telling them anything. This is how you feel. You feel like this is an ongoing battle, battle of how you feel like you don't really have either the support that you need around you. That it's just you out here alone. You're already going through the struggle as it is, but now you're feeling drained. And you're just trying to, you in this energy of learning from your past or learning from this mistake. You feel like next time I go through a situation, I'm going to keep this to myself. Or I know not to tell this person. Maybe I need to tell a counselor or tell a stranger or something, but I know not to tell this person is. Because the moon energy gives me like a secret that's something hidden. And this gives me a lot of emotion. So you really feel some type of way about this. This really hurts you. This hits you close to the heart. That this person, you feel like they were your backbone. But now you're in this energy of learning from the past of not telling this person anything. This is a person looking to the past. And as you see, this person's face is mad. So I feel like you are upset that this person really did this to you. This was your secret. This was your person that you trusted. 
And now you're like, when I get out this situation, because I'm pulling myself out this situation, you don't got to hear or worry about me. Gemini coming out here again. You don't have to, especially with Jupiter coming out here. Jupiter is the planet of expansion and money and finances. So I feel like you're going through this financial situation right now, but you're like, when I get out of this, I'm keeping this stuff to myself. This is what you're thinking. You're in your head. You're just in this moment of trying to find solutions and pull yourself out of this situation. But you're also wanting to kind of like let this situation go. But now you're just like, I'm just learning from it. I know who to trust and who not to trust. I'm not going to tell my business. This is you wanting to keep something to yourself. And this person really sitting here waiting for you to come and apologize. This person thinks with the fool coming out in reverse, this person thinks you're foolish. And why would they talk to me that way? And it wasn't that serious. And for you know that this person made a poor judgment. This was not their business to tell. This wasn't a business to tell. So this person thinking you're going to come back and come apologize to them that you're going to have this new beginning that they're, they're expecting you to return. So let's see. What's the advice for Sagittarius here? What's the advice? I, I get this energy that you're apprehensive about telling this person this. Like, it, something really upsets you. You're already going through your own struggles as it is. But overall, you just want to you just want to be happy. Please clarify this. I feel like right now you're going through a setback, but at the end of the day, you're going to, you're going to forgive this person. I don't see you apologizing, but I feel like you're going to forgive this person. But right now, it's just not the time. I'm getting right now in the present, you are frustrated. You're still upset. You're hurt that this person even said this or told, or told your business. Somebody's name could be with the letter C, first, middle, last name, or a location, or something could be important to the letter C. Maybe somebody's car got repossessed with C coming out. So right now, you're not going to apologize because you are dealing with this setback. Like, this is your focus. You don't care to apologize. You're not coming to say anything. But at the end of the day, I feel like things will be, y'all be fine or y'all work it out, but you just know not to trust this person anymore. Like you'll worry about that when you get back on your feet. Because I see right now at the bottom of the deck, you have loss here, misfortune, dealing with your own situations. You're trying to pay for something, pay for this unpaid bill, pay this debt, or find a new job or something. That's your focus right now. Letter Q could be significant, first, middle, last name, or somebody's nickname could be Queen. What else is going on? You have um, Archangel Haniel coming out. This speaks to like, you have joy coming out twice. Joy, 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 joy. You're going to learn your lesson. You have blessings coming in. You will be blessed. You will get over the situation. You're going to be happy. They're blessing you with something. And now they just wanted you to see something that was going on. Especially with intuition coming out here, they wanted you to see who was leaking your business. Maybe, maybe you sent something, or maybe you were just in this energy of wondering, like, how do certain people know things about you if you never told them? You know, you go to the family party, the barbecue, the family reunion, or something to just be out there. You're just wondering, like, how did this person know? I feel like they just wanted you to be aware that this was going on. They really want you to look at this as a blessing that you found this information out, and also that a blessing is still coming in for you. You have a blessing coming in. That's good. Somebody's birthday could be on the 15th. Oh, yeah. There we go. 
Archangel Raphael. This speaks of justice, harmony, finding solutions. So this is a blessing. I mean, this is. I feel like this is bringing some harmony back into your life because I feel like you find out you found out where the leak was coming from, like how certain things was leaking out there. You have a person that you're close to, but unfortunately, this person loves to run their mouth. They love to talk. They love to gossip. They. It don't matter if they telling a family member and. And it's not a malicious way. This person just still tells your business. And now you're finding this out. So this is kind of bringing balance back into your life to figure out, like, why are certain things getting out? How does my aunt know about this? How does so-and-so know that I just bought this car? I didn't post it. I didn't tell anybody about it. This is how. It's because it's being leaked by the person you're closest to. And now you're going to find a solution. The solution is not to tell this person anything. Anything you don't want to get around to anybody else. Don't tell this person. Keep certain things close to, close to you. That's what they want you to know. This is actually a blessing in disguise. And they want you to be aware. Somebody could be 36 years old or their birthday could be on the 9th. So I feel like you're actually going to be happy. Things are going to be fine. And also, look. Look at this. Blessings. Harmony. Solution coming in. New beginnings coming in. Somebody's birthday could be on the 20th. You have new beginnings coming in. Optimism. Hope. Okay, okay, Sagittarius. All right, that's all I have for you. If anything resonated, please leave me a message down below. And thumbs up the video. Take care.